Astronauts who left the International Space Station have splashed out off the coast of California after a medical issue prompted their mission to be cut a month short. The footage released by NASA showed astronaut Mike Finik, Zana Cardman, Olga Platonov, and Kimia Yui exiting SpaceX's Crew Dragon capsule. They were seen smiling and giving a thumbs up to those present. Meanwhile, a NASA official revealed that the ailing astronaut is doing fine. I, as I mentioned in my in my prepared remarks, uh, all crew members right now are uh, they're they're safe, uh, they're in good spirits, they're going through the standard uh, post splashdown medical checks. I believe uh, the helicopter, if it hasn't uh, left the recovery ship, it, it's imminent. Uh, to do so, and they're all going uh, to the hospital as we um, as we had determined days ago as the proper thing to do under the circumstances. But as I mentioned, the crew member uh, in question specifically is doing fine. Now, this marks the very first instant when an astronaut in need of medical attention has been evacuated from the ISS by NASA, along with three other crew members. A few hours before footage showed the astronauts strapped into the crew cabin seated side by side. They were wearing their white and black space suits. Subsequently, SpaceX's Crew Dragon capsule parachuted into the sea off San Diego, capping a 10 hour plus descent from the ISS. The four returning members of Crew 11 mission from the United States, Russia, and Japan undocked from the ISS after five months in space. However, NASA officials reportedly refused to identify the astronaut who needed medical care last week. They also did not divulge the health concerns, stressing that it wasn't an emergency situation. The outgoing space station commander, Mike Phoenix, said earlier that the ailing astronaut is stable, safe, and well cared for. Launched in August of last year, the Crew 11 Quartet had been scheduled to stay on the space station until mid-February. This means the decision to return to Earth cut short their mission by over a month. Regarding the splashdown, NASA says that it would stick to the same entry and procedures at flight's end with the usual assortment of medical experts aboard the recovery ship. Computer modeling predicts the need for a medical evacuation from the space station every three years, but NASA hasn't had one, of, one in 65 years of human Space flight. In 1985, Soviet cosmonaut Vladimir Vusyutin came down with a serious infection or related in illness aboard the, his country's Salyut 7 station, prompting an early return. For all the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.